You're now right inside the jailbreak that revealed America's changed role in Iraq. They think they're rescuing Kurds from this ISIS jail, but look who staggers out. Terrified Iraqis. Even their eyes lit up by fear, caught on the Kurdish soldier's helmet camera. It's edited, but US officials tell CNN it's genuine. More cells opened, it seems, and the Iraqi soldier and civilian hostages keep coming. An office, an ISIS flag. More cells. And perhaps a target through the light of the door. Then a quick close up, likely of an American commando. Don't be afraid, he cries as they search the prisoners. Remember, they were expecting Kurds. Perhaps these men are ISIS, have guns or bombs. It's the Americans who seem in charge here. The captives' relief palpable. U.S. officials saying they faced imminent execution. It's unclear when, before or after this footage, the Americans here learned one of their own was gunned down. But their mission went on to rescue 70. That first combat death since 2011 in Iraq, forcing public acknowledgement, American commandos were now boots on the ground. Now, Jonathan, actually, in just the last few minutes, uh, CENTCOM, American Pentagon, uh, have released a cockpit video uh, that seems to show, that they say shows, a uh, devastating explosion that they say hit, hit, in fact, that ISIS compound that you just saw in that video, destroying it once, obviously, uh, those American and Kurdish special forces had withdrawn. Now, uh, I refer to the casualty in that report there, the Americans sustained. That was Master Sergeant Joshua Wheeler, 39 years old, a veteran of 14 tours in Afghanistan and Iraq. Jonathan, remarkable. It gives you just a sense of perspective, really, on how lengthily engaged the U.S. has been in what used to be the war on terror and is now that complex war fighting ISIS. Barack Obama has pledged there wouldn't be boots on the ground initially, that they were going to pull out of Iraq and Afghanistan, but now it appears, you see in that video, how close to the front line, in fact, on the front line, those American commandos were, leading to the death of one of their number.